Hello. It's Hello. Ingrid. It is Mike Butcher. And Ingrid London from TechCrunch. Hello. We're here for a little startup alley pitch off, which should be pretty cool. Uh, a few hand selected startups, and we're going to hear a little bit about them and have a little chit chat. Yeah, so this is a showcase that we do every disrupt. We uh, basically have a showcase of the startups, and um, uh, this is our little pick. It's not a competition, it's just a, an exposition. Yeah. Not a beauty contest. Not a beauty contest. <laughs> so the first up. First up is Evo Grow. Exactly. Hello. Go ahead. Okay, thank you. My name's Jason Hurst. I'm founder of Evo Grow. We make indoor plant growing systems for chefs. We make it easy to grow your own perfect salad leaves, microgreens, and herbs. We make cabinets fitted out with LEDs and hydroponics, a range of environmental sensors, and up to 32 cameras, and we monitor the conditions in the cabinet and each plant's growth. They're connected to the cloud, we gather that data, we analyze it against our models, and we program each cabinet to suit every plant and what stage of growth it's got to. We take all that complexity away from our customers, so they have a system which is simple, reliable, and productive. Right now, we sell to restaurants and hotels. We have six Michelin star chefs as customers, hotels like Claridge's and the Ritz in London, Fundamentally, what they like is the taste of the produce that we produce is better than anything they can buy. That's pretty Thank cool. Thank you very much, Evo Grow. Thank you. What do you yeah. think? Uh, That's very cool. Really? Well, I'm a bit of a um, micro green fiend. I love them. Mm. So I would totally. I've eaten you at your house. You are a green <laughs> fiend, aren't you? <laughs> that's right. Delicious I like food. The, I like the herbs. Um, yeah. But you know, I think that um, I think that sounds really cool. It's. Um, Totally, you can imagine it's like way, way fresher to do that. Yeah. And if, in, in a big urban center where you've got restaurants, you exactly. don't have the space to do that sort of thing. Not everybody can be Alice Waters with Chez Panisse in Berkeley. I guess if you got, wanted you know. to be really um, crazy at home, you could sort of get this sort of thing for your house as well. Yeah. Um, but I mean, obviously, the industrial applications are, are there for the you know, commercial kitchens and, uh, and things yeah. like that. And uh, perhaps somebody might grow other types of green things exactly. in it as well. Exactly, it looks that might quite be hydroponic. Actually. Hydroponic <laughs> is a word I might use. Yes. So well, who have we got next? Yeah. Okay, we've got Flito up next. Hello. Please okay. go ahead. Okay, Mr. Ar. Flito는 언어의 장벽을 가장 빠르고 가장 정확하고 효율적으로 번역하는 서비스입니다. See, different people, different languages. There's tons of people out there who can speak more than one language. Yeah. We bring all those yeah. people's talent into Flito's platform to create cross-source translation service. You can uh, type in text, you can take a picture, you can record your voice uh, through an application you download it on uh, at Android Market or App Store, and Flito pushes push notification through over one million translators mobile app for them to participate in the real-time translation, and you can get most accurate translation. It took on only one hour to translate whole tech crunch in five different languages. So you can come up to our booth, scan QR code, and you can read tech crunch in your native language. We support up to 18 different languages, and I just recorded my voice in Korean, and this is how fast and accurate translation gets. Which camera are we on? Flito is the world's fastest, most accurate and efficient translation on? service that breaks the language barrier. Thank you very much. Thank you. Very nice pitch. Amazing. So, Great well, pitch. that was, uh, I actually had no idea what was going on at the beginning yeah, of that. I know. I thought, um, I'm, I need to brush up on my Japanese. I feel like that pretty much I all the time, Japanese. by the way. Um, yeah, <laughs> that's so, like, uh, well, that sounded pretty good. I mean, uh, look, there are a ton of uh, translation apps out there. Google Translate, obviously the most famous. Exactly. Uh, but it's interesting how they're creating a marketplace for this. So, what I quite like about it is, yeah, the marketplace, they're trying to gamify it with the whole point system. And then it's all voice-based. Yeah. Um, so that actually is very mobile friendly. Yeah. Um, and I know there are others that's doing that. If they can, I think the winner in this space is gonna be the one that actually produces the most fault-free translation. Yeah. So like the more awkward it sounds, the, uh, the, the, the less it's gonna get used. So well, you know, depending on how fast it is, it could be incredibly useful if you're traveling abroad yeah. uh, or in a you know, business situation where you need to translate something quite quickly. That yeah. could be useful. Or taxi drivers. Yeah, Fantastic. exactly. Or like, you know, if you need to buy a microgreen plant. <laughs> um, Fantastic. Okay. So here we have the Next third one up. up. We have spray, spray printers. Spray painters. Yes. Okay. Go for, Hello. It. Go for it. I am Richard, and there is nothing more uninspiring than a boring 
blank wall. I'm here to introduce you Spray Printer. Spray Printer is a device that delivers photos and designs from your smartphone to any wall. It's as simple as that. You have the Spray Printer, you have our application, you choose what you want to print on your wall, activate the ah. printer, and with your own free hand, you release the artist in you. The idea is that your smartphone always knows where That's your printer exactly is. That's the way we can release over 200 pixels per second to any wall with any color. It's fun to print a selfie once, but for professional designers, we are creating a marketplace where professional designers can upload their creation and the owners of Spray Printer can download them. So Spray Printer will be available in Indiegogo platform for crowdfunding early next year. Sign up at sprayprinter.com. Thank you. Fantastic. That's interesting. It's a very unusual product, this, and I found these guys, we did a meetup in Tallinn a couple of weeks ago, Tallinn, Estonia, which is chock full of amazing entrepreneurs, yeah. just like Skype, etc. You, so you're Estonian? And, and uh, yeah. yeah, and so these guys were in Estonia, and uh, yeah. it's very clever, isn't it? So the smartphone does know where you are on the wall, and off you go, you can print it to the wall. That's pretty brilliant, yeah, I mean, but you're using anything, you know, a special spray can to Yeah, they? they have developed a special spray uh, spray can adjust, um, things that goes onto a spray Amazing. can. So it's quite clever, 3D printed yeah. and everything. Well, Banksy yeah. is clearly, you know, dying somewhere. Yeah, Banksy, he's, he's your number upset. is up. Yeah, it's that's all over it. for Banksy. That's it, Banksy. So, but, I mean, it looks kind of cool. Yeah. Uh, I think that the use case is a sort of a funny one because I mean I don't know how many wall paintings we're going to want with this sort of thing, but well, you can kind of I don't know any kind of amateur could use this yeah. instead of having to be a actually really really you know professional at it. I think it reminds me of sort of a dot matrix printer for a wall. Almost. Yeah, mm. I mean I actually think that there's probably further on some really interesting applications with this. Like the more refined you get with the instrument that you're using for the printing, you yeah. can do. You can sell them to decorators, for example, to do patterns on the walls, you know, so people can get, for example, William Morris wallpaper, you know, inspired by William Morris, um, and, and the decorator can actually put it on rather than wallpaper, yeah. you know, something like that could be yeah. quite interesting. You could do anything you like. Yeah. Well, that's been our sh showcase yeah, of Startup Alley are... for today. Yeah, and, uh, thank you. And so I'm sure everyone is having a great time out there. Um, and uh, so from me, Mike Butcher. And from me, Ingrid London, we will see you soon. Thank you.